Caleb, you got one more time to touch me, bro. We're gonna be playing a different weight to attend. <laughs> Look, bro, just clear your mind, and we can forget about everything this weekend and have a good time. Waiter, can we get some drinks around this joint? Look, man, I keep telling you, if you ain't got no game, you ain't never gonna get to play. <laughs> never gonna get to play. Hi, my lady. It's okay, I promise. Good friends are hard to come by. You should feel lucky you have two of them. <laughs> I have one, and she's like a sister to What's me. What's her name? Is she hot? Her name is Naomi, and she's extremely hot. Mr. Crenshaw, what's up, big timer? You ready for the spotlight? No way, man. Are you serious? I'm not messing with you at all, man. I've got the deal in hand right here. So, uh, when can you get here? Man, look, I... <laughs> wow. Okay, just give me, man, give me like a week or two. That sounds good, man. Hey, congratulations, buddy. I'm really proud of you. You've earned this. Besides, when I go to work, and I hear your song on that radio, <laughs> <laughs> your mama is going to lose it because I'm going to be telling everybody that is my baby boy. <laughs> Jerry. Jared, huh? if God is so good, why would he let so many bad things happen to one man? I had one good thing going for me. One. And that was my mother. Dude, are we going to get out or what? Bro, I'm ready to eat. Is he ignoring us? Oh, he's looking at pictures of Grace. Dude, this is our chance to get Jared and Grace back together. I mean, it's gonna be all because of you, but Grace may be so excited that she hooks me up with Naomi. Wait, is that all you worry about is Naomi? But hey, Grace does owe me a favor, bro. I just hand it off to you. Dude, I'm so excited, man. Forget eating, man. Let's go plan this fundraiser. Forget eating. Bro, I wanna stay. You know what, bro? Everyone was right about you. You are a broken mess. You will always be a broken mess. Because if you fully live up to the potential and level of awesomeness that God has planned for you, you won't have a crush to lean on. Everyone's had crappy past, Jared, but we don't choose to live there. Man, God has given you this awesome ability to sing. And all you want is for everyone to feel sorry for you. Man, God gave you grace at a time in your life when you were at your lowest. And she did everything right, man. She checked off all the boxes. But one little mistake and you completely write her out of your life. Man, she, she was so excited to see you at the hometown fundraiser. Man, she's the best thing that's ever happened to you. And you're too stupid to see it and fix it. Man, you know what, bro? I'm done. Wait. Grace knew about the fundraiser. It was her idea. All right, all right. Ladies and gentlemen, we thank y'all for coming out today. I want to congratulate all our winners. And something I want to tell y'all is that we raised all the money for our town's grants. Which means no increased taxes. Yet anyways, I told y'all both of them couldn't be here, but I lied. Y'all help me welcome your hometown hero, Jared Crenshaw. Man, so good to be here, back in my hometown. Everything I've ever held near and dear to me, I've lost. And I'll be honest, I blame God for a lot of that. <laughs>